Next step even elongation. Ribosomes has two sides for transfer RNA called P and A. The initial uh, the initial transfer RNA with attached amino acid is in P site and transfer RNA responding to next codon on mRNA bind to A site. The ribosomes catalyze a transfer RNA from the forming a new peptide bond. Then the ribosome moved the completely empty transfer RNA will be moved to the P site, which is displaced of the ribosomes and the transfer RNA that has a growing peptide chain on it, it is moved from A side to P side. The process is then repeated as the transfer RNA, which is present at the P side, hold the peptide chain and the new transfer RNA bind to A side. Then the peptide chain is transferred in onto amino acid attached as to the by transfer RNA and moving the transfer RNA with the peptide chain from A side to P side. And the process is going. Then here you can see the here is a messenger RNA. Uh, 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 and there is the largest of uh, P side and E side. The first transfer RNA will be moved here, then it will move uh, on P side. And uh, once it will, uh, is repeated and on terminate, three codon are called squarely, uh, terminate the translation, and it is a uh, there is no need for more protein synthesis. So that codon actually is the signal, uh, a cell to stop that proteins. And there are uh, three codon that uh, work as a uh, stop codon, uh, UGA, UAG, and UAA. They call for knowing it and protein in the so region. That bind that protein card release factor bind and ribosomes, the mRNA and new polypeptide to separate. Then all the subunits will get separated and the process of translation will be stopped. Then there are some post-translational modifications uh, have to done. New polypeptide usually fold themselves spontaneously into their active conformation. However, protein and in folding process is by capron which is a brain bonded organelle which is present in the cytoplasm. Many proteins are targeted to specific organelles with the targeting the polypeptide, which are moved from final protein after translation. This is how the process of translation taken place. I hope you like that. Stay connected.